Hey there stampers and welcome to another Trending Tuesday. I saw this one when I bought the magazine and I loved it and I thought oh I just I don't have anything to make this. So I've been waiting and kind of accruing and thinking about how to create this one and um, I do have to say it's one of my favorites. So this is kind of what I came up with. Um, you know not an exact copy but I thought it came out close and it sure captured the spirit. So I'm going to go ahead and show you, I'm not going to do it for you, but I'm going to show you what I did. I used the stem, this crumb cake, and I used uh, Kraft White Ink. This is the stem from Fifth Avenue Floral, and I stamped it, but then I um, just created a longer, I see there's no end to it, there's no cap. So I just created a longer line with it. Um, and then I went in with Early Espresso, Soft Suede, Crumb Cake, and just created lines to give it sort of that mottled look that's in the original. Um, and so that was pretty easy. For the bird, I used Nature's Walk, and I stamped him in Stays On Black. And then I came back in with Nature's Place, this um, bar of music in in Early Espresso, I mean in Stays on Black, over the bird image. And then I inked him with Cobbler and um, So Saffron, sponged it on, I cut him out, and then I inked the edges in um, black. And that, and I popped the birdie up on dimensionals. So that's how I created the bird. And then I, I came back in using the same bar of music in white, craft white, and not going all the way in. And then I sponged in craft white. And then I thought this one kind of looked like, I liked this font because it looked like it was singing, sort of. I don't know what font looks like singing, but to me. So I just did that in stays on. Used crumb, I mean uh, cherry cobbler seam binding ribbon a uh, crumb cake button and some linen thread tied it on and that's it and I think it captured it pretty well I really like this card and I might play with this sort of image more now that I've done it here but anyway I hope this inspires you to try your own and have fun with it whenever you see somebody else's that's maybe not stamping up stamps you can try to recreate it using what you have and we'll see you next time bye